Disturbing details in an Orange Park investigation, two women stand accused of committing heinous crimes against a child. It's certainly very disturbing uh, to hear about this happening to any child. 62-year-old Wanda Cummings and 34-year-old Wanicia Cummings are both facing first-degree felony child abuse and child neglect charges. Their bond, a half million dollars each. Yeah, we want to warn you, some of the details in this story may be difficult to hear. News for Jacks reporter Eric Avenia is joining us live from Orange Park to explain the allegations against both women. Yes, Kent, the allegations of what happened inside this home are so horrendous that I had to read over this arrest report several times just to fully grasp what police say happened to a 13-year-old boy. We're talking about what pretty much amounts to torture of a child. It was inside this Orange Park home where investigators say a 13-year-old boy was severely abused and neglected. Police arrested 62-year-old Wanda Cummings and 34-year-old Juanicia Cummings in connection to the abuse. Neighbors who did not want to be identified say they suspected something wasn't right when police started going door-to-door -door asking questions. They kind of got the idea it had something to do with the little boy because we hadn't seen him. But we didn't know the extent of what really was going on. According to this arrest report, the boy was malnourished and dirty. He had 55 scars, bruises, cuts, gashes, and burn marks to his body. The report also states the boy had to undergo emergency surgery at Children's Hospital. It ain't no sense no kid having to go through something like that. This should not be happening. We cannot have this inhumane treatment of children continuing. The boy told police that Wanda Cummings put him in a tight box and kept him there for an extended period of time where he was forced to urinate on himself. Police say the boy had also been chained to furniture for several days and locked inside a laundry room where he was restrained with zip ties and tape. The boy told police the blisters on his hands came from the zip ties. No one here could ever imagine anything like this. This, this is horrible. A background check on Wanda Cummings turned up a 2012 arrest for child abuse, but she was never convicted after completing a diversion program. Now, DCF also confirms that that 13-year-old boy and other children who were living in the home have been removed from this residence and are now in the care of relatives. Now, coming up at 11, uh, you'll find out that child abuse isn't the only charge uh, these two women are facing. They're also facing uh, one count of animal abuse. I'll have the details coming up at 11. You do not want to miss this. Reporting live in Orange Park, Eric Avenier, Channel 4, The Local Station.